Hundreds of students across Northeast Indiana are quarantining at home and will be out of school for at least two weeks after classmates tested positive for the coronavirus. All students at Maple Creek Middle School in the Ford are temporarily learning from home. And Fort Wayne's NBC reporter Corinne Rose takes us to Northwest Allen County. After having zero cases of coronavirus at Northwest Allen's Maple Creek Middle School this fall, 10 of its 916 students tested positive last week with no known connections. They're in different grade levels. They're from completely different groups of teachers and teams. And so we have every indication to believe that these, um, the actual exposure um, happen in different locations and different activities. Um, we have no reason to believe that the exposure occurred with the, within the same group. Contact tracing led to another 140 Maple Creek middle schoolers who may have been exposed to the positive students. While no teachers were determined to have been exposed, having more than 10 percent of students out of the building prompted administrators to order remote learning for all Maple Creek students this week. This is the only place we've had an outbreak. Um, if you look at our district as a whole, um, 30, we've had 30 total student cases in nine weeks, and 10 of them were in one school in one week. He says positive student cases seem to follow a pattern of emerging after a holiday or Indiana's move to stage five of its reopening plan. Two-thirds of our total student cases either happened last week or five to seven days after Labor Day. And, and so it just reiterates um, the importance of taking safety precautions, not only when they're in school, but when they're outside of school as well. Himsel says staff began additional deep cleaning in the building last week when they got word of the first cases, and then it continues this week. We concentrate on frequently touched surfaces. Um, we will concentrate on all surfaces um, in this particular case. Most students will return to class on October 20th after the district's fall break. Those who tested positive may return after 10 days of isolation, plus being fever free for 24 hours without medication. Students who are exposed to them may return after quarantining for 14 days from the last date of exposure to that person and be fever free for 24 hours. Corinne Rose, Fort Wayne's NBC. Well, Adam Central Schools also began all virtual learning today after two students tested positive and 80 others had to be quarantined. Students will return to in-school classes there after that district's fall break October 27th.